Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we're playing some Magic Arena. We're playing some budget magic. We're playing a, a blue-white heroic deck, which means it's creatures that get buffs when you cast spells on them. So you can see this Battlewise Hoplite has heroic. Whenever you cast a spell that targets Battlewise Hoplite, put a plus one, plus one counter and scry one. So this works with enchantments like uh, Staggering Insight or Cartouche of Knowledge. It also works with our... Um, Protection spells like Sajiri Shelter. Uh, we have Illuminator Virtuoso, which has a 1 1 with double strike and it connives when we target it with a spell. So that means we can throw away a spell like Filter and Rummage through our hand, make this guy bigger, we'll slip out by the back for more protection, some more card draw. Sentinel's Eyes is really good because you can escape it from your graveyard for cheap. Got the best doggo for some more protection. Got another heroic creature, so this is the favoured hoplite. Um, put a plus one, plus one counter and prevent all damage. Then a fear armor for a cheap enchantment that makes things bigger. And then uh, another cheap uh, cantrip which targets our creatures. So, uh, yeah, it looks like a fun little deck. Should be okay in historic. So let's take it into the ladder and see how it does. So we're in Explorer Play Queue with our uh, blue white aggro deck, our heroic deck. Ah, uh, this start looks okay. So we'll play Illuminator Virtuoso on two. Okay, it looks like we're up against soldiers. by stacking insight. Throw away the ring of sustenance. <coughs> wow, getting in for ten double strike. Five double strike. So that's ten life link and draw two cards. <laughs> Oh, well, that sucks. That ruins our day. <laughs> We're off to a good start, but now we haven't got a creature. We should have kept that protection spell, eh? <laughs> Okay, favourite hoplite. Oh, that got rid of our enchantment. Darn it. Ah, that backfired.
Oh, we might get the win. Oh, we just clutched out the win there. Nice. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> okay, we're back playing our blue-white heroic deck. We are just managed to sneak out a win last game, which is quite neat. Okay, opponents in the tank. Really thinking hard about this mulligan. Or they're just AFK, one or the other. Hmm. Okay, opponents out of there. Good, good hard fought victory there. Okay, we're back playing our um, blue white heroic deck. Got a favoured hoplite to start the game, so that's not too bad. Ethereal armor. Okay, another slip out the back. Shame we haven't got any blue. Okay, opponents taking rid of our protection, which is kind of annoying. Another planes, that's not what we need. We need the blue mana to um, phase out our hoplite. That was kind of bad for us, unfortunately. Another blue card, that's no good. Now we get the blue mana, now we need a creature. Uh, we're drawing nothing but duds right now. We need another creature to get down on the battlefields. This game's not going very well, unfortunately. We are uh, totally whiffed on getting a second creature out. <laughs> we whiffed on our protection so we didn't have blue. Oh well, never mind, next game. 
Okay, starting hand seems fine. We've got a couple of creatures and we've got um, some enchantments, so that's fine. Looks like we're up against a control deck, which is not the best for us. Okay, off to a good start so far. Omen of the Sea for the opponent. We'll just have to see if they have a board wipe or something. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> Got the win. Nice. Too fast for control. Okay, so that was our budget budget uh, blue white heroic deck. I think it worked pretty well. Um, there's one deck where one game where it kind of misfired and kind of sputtered out where we didn't have a creature. But I think you know that's the kind of price you pay. You can either be like powerful or consistent at this level with uh, uncommons. So I think. The fact that this deck has the potential to be really strong and like we certainly closed out those two winning games quite easily. You know, I think you just have to accept that sometimes the cards aren't going to come together in the right order. So you've got three elements, you've got like creature buffs and protection and you know you want like a mix of all three. And so if you draw two, two of them and miss one element then you're kind of stuck. But um, yeah it was quite a neat little deck, I thought it worked quite well. and. Um, Definitely worth a craft and a play, something different to try out. Um, quite fun, fast games. So thanks very much for watching, hope you all enjoyed and we'll see you next time.